Well, you remember him from Entertainment Tonight and uh, radio uh, ra on his radio show, Intelligence for Your Life, which has been impacting millions of people around the country for years. He's one of my favorite people. He's also one of my favorite people to talk to because I just feel so encouraged every time we have a conversation. I'd like to welcome my friend, John Tesh. Hi, John. Hey, it's great to be with you again, Michael. Uh, maybe for some folks that really aren't familiar with your journey, talk about that incredible uh, path from local TV to uh, to really being on the number one uh, show at the time it's so funny how similar we are i did what you did i just showed up at a radio station my hair down to here because i couldn't afford to cut it I, at a radio station it's a kind of sweeping floors and they're like what and, and so i was there and i was sweeping floors and i was going to get coffee with people and i heard my voice and they said hey you know you're a good kid would you like to do a, a little test and so i did a test and they're like yeah maybe not and then rick dees who is at that station if you remember rick dees yeah, rick he left and a, and a news guy left and i got a, i got a job reading the uh, news and, on sunday mornings and, and playing the religious tapes i got my foot in the door um and then from you know listen if, in 36 months i went from homeless to being a, 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 a news correspondent at WCBS TV, uh, New York, I mean, at 23 years old. And it was just, and that's how I say on stage, that's how I know there's a Holy Spirit because I was, <laughs> I was being looked after. And what I did was I, I just bounced around. I did what you do. I just, you know, I, I, found, I found a way in and then I worked my butt off. And, and then you you found yourself on the national stage. And John, I remember you telling me this, that uh, when you were on Entertainment Tonight, um, just, it's almost like you felt like being a beetle, I think is what you said, is is uh, just, it was, it was literally just such an incredible show. And so what was it like sitting there day after day with Mary Hart and getting you to do these incredible adventures? It was, it was wild because here I was, I had done, I, I was a newscaster for 12 years, right? At, you know, at the flagship station for CBS. And then, and CBS Sports said, hey, we want you to come work for the network. I didn't know anything about sports. But they said, don't worry about it. You're going to cover like, weird sports like the Tour de France bike race, which was weird back then. Uh, downhill skiing, figure skating, gymnastics, you know, all of that stuff. So I did that and I lived in Europe for, for six years. And then uh, Entertainment Tonight found an old tape of me anchoring the news in Nashville with, with Pat Sajak. Uh, back in 1974, and they said, "Oh, we we looking for a newsier approach to entertainment tonight. Would you like to come and work for us?" And they and I said, uh, "Yeah, what kind of a contract?" And they said, 13 weeks." And I was like, "Ah, why not?" You know, and that's what you got to say in this business every now and then. Yeah. Why not? So I went out there, and yeah, I went from you know because your voice is is who you are on sports announcing. Nobody sees your face really, unless you're one of the superstars like Gifford or one of those guys or Al Michaels. But then. Uh, I, I, I'm on Entertainment Tonight with Mary Hart for, I don't know, a week. And 23 million people a night were watching that show. I, you know, we were like Seinfeld back, back in the day. And yeah, yeah. You, couldn't walk to, you couldn't walk on the street. Uh, and, you know, and sometimes you had like six pounds of makeup on. So you looked like you were getting ready to rob the 7-Eleven. But it was <laughs> when, you left, when you left work. But it was, the, it, yeah, it, was, it was an amazing time because... My favorite part of it was I could always get a table at a restaurant. That's yeah. that's how I measured my success. <laughs> but something that you've released, John, that uh, I, I really love, and it's something that uh, everybody can access 24 seven uh, online. It's called Tesh TV. Uh, talk about what you've created with this and how people are being encouraged. Yeah, it's very simple, actually. You know, it's, and I, I, I love it. There's a great book that you would love. It's called The Pixar Way. And it's about how the folks at Pixar never used a whiteboard. They just tested stuff out. And you've seen me do it. I've seen you do it. You tested yourself out. Uh, and, and what we did was we said, well, I wonder what people, I'd love to do something that's faith-based uh, that really helped me. And that's what you do. You do what makes you come alive. And so I, I, I was sitting here one day and I just started playing, you know, playing piano. I don't have it rigged into the, the microphone, but and I used to, and I would, I would just play random stuff, which I love doing anyway. And, and I, and I would read scripture, you know, just, just any random scripture with that. And I had like strings behind it and stuff. And I said, and I had a friend say, why don't you put that online? And I did, and people were like, oh my gosh, this is how I wake up every morning or whatever. So we just created a very, like a WordPress site, Tesh TV. And you can go on there, it's free, you can sign up and it's free. And you can just 24 seven, you can be bathed in, in, in that, in the word of God. Yeah, that's, it's such an incredible tool. We're going to put some information on your screen where you can find and subscribe to Tesh TV. And also, John has an excellent book called Relentless, Unleashing a Life of Purpose, Grit, and Faith. If you know someone who's walking through cancer or you're, you yourself are walking through cancer, it's such an encouraging read. Thank you so much, John, for your time. It's always so good to see you. It's great to see you, too. Thank you. And congratulations. It's great to watch you. Thank you.